I keep trying to tell myself that I'm just jealous of Walker Sloan's progress. It was only five years ago that he first showed up at Alchemax, talking about harnessing energy from the fourth dimension. Now he won't stop until he's running the place. I know his type. He's thinking beyond Alchemax, aiming towards who knows what. He's the exact type of corporate monster I've sworn to rein in. Especially if he's mucking with time travel. The year 2099 might not be much, but it's all mine and he's not going to change it. He's been siphoning Alchemax resources into converting the Gateway and the old virtual unreality lab into something else. Something dangerous. I've tried talking to him, but he's got no time for Miguel O'Hara. But people make time for Spider-Man. Just use the convenient access to the ventilation system to get inside, and then Walker and I can have a little chat. Whatever Sloane's up to, I've got to shut it down before he gets in over his head and drags everyone and everything down with him. I see they've been keeping busy in the cybernetics division. Well, it's a lot of shocking robots down there. As Miguel O'Hara, Alchemax geneticist, I could have walked right in. But at night, the security protocols kick in. 
the genetics lab. Without that department, I wouldn't be the man I am today. Sloane's gotta be around here somewhere. I just know it. You'd think the largest tech developer in the world could afford to carpet their air ducts for extra comfort. Holographic Assistant, online. How may I serve you, Mr. Sloan? Hello, Joseph. Run a final check and initiate security bioscans. Preparing systems, Mr. Sloan. This won't take long. Bioscan sequence initiated. Access to time research lab granted, Mr. Sloan. Slow down, Miguel. Take your time. Don't want to get caught here. Alchemax should be thanking me. Stark Fujikawa Industries is going to take over this entire corporation. Unless someone steps up to do it. You're the only one who thinks outside the box enough to do it, sir. Yes, Joseph, I know. I knew he was up to something. I'm almost embarrassed it took me so long to come up with it. I simply go back in time and launch Alchemax years before it was originally founded. Not only can I remake Alchemax in my image, but you can dismantle Stark Fujikawa before it gets started. You're a genius, sir. I programmed you well, Joseph. Oh, no. You don't get away from me that easily. Of course, the CEO will want me to have that degree of power. He's all about power, but he won't have anything to say about it by the time I'm done. Security scan sequence initiated. Granted, Mr. Sloan. Yep, he's heading for his time research lab, all right. There's an access point near the generator.
thing's almost fully charged and I don't have a clue how to shut it down. Only chance is to get to the lab before it's too late. If I don't get there in time, he could actually pull this off, go into the past and tamper with who knows what. is what it is. Am I the only newspaper man in the city that realizes what a menace that webhead is? Oh, uh, Jonah, um, indoor voice, okay? I'm trying to get Mary Jane on the phone. People lionizing that freak. Next thing you know, there'll be a musical about him with a chorus line of dancing Spider-Man. I'd pay to see that. Oh, Mary Jane, hi. Go see a show. Uh, MJ, I, I would love to, but I'm working with Dr. Octavius in the genetics lab on a DNA project. I had to download a sample of my own DNA into the permanent Alchemax genetic files. I'm still waiting for some test results. Permanent files, huh? Great, so a hundred years from now we can clone you. <laughs> yeah, I don't think so. Well, how about I come there and we grab a late dinner afterward, okay, Tiger? Uh, sure, it's okay. Anything for you, babe. And I love when you call me Tiger. It's like a blast from the past. What? What just happened? Intruder in time research lab. Maximum force can be used. They are great. Robot sentries. I'm not sure I can take them right now. Maybe I can draw them off. Move fast enough to distract him with some decoys. <laughs> Kicking my butt right now. So move! Too much security in this place. Gotta get out of here. <sighs>
did it. That lunatic actually did it. I saw it all. Reinforcements have been summoned. Odds of intruder designated Spider-Man departing this facility alive are minimal to non-existent. Parker's the only one who can help me stop Sloan now. I'll pull his DNA records, get the last known sample, and slap together a chronal link. I just hope this works. It's a little outside my specialty. Get the shock out of my way. Pursuit target. I need to find somewhere quiet so I can hear myself and Parker think. Peter. Peter Parker. Who's that? Who's talking? Miguel O'Hara, the Spider-Man from 2099. Are, are the other me's in my head, too? No. It's just me and you, old-timer. I threw together a chronal link program using a sample of your DNA. It's allowing me to communicate with you at the point in time it was taken. I just wish it was from earlier on. We have almost no time. Time until what? Until you're killed. Un until I'm what now? Because it kind of sounded like you said killed. Listen, a lunatic named Walker Sloan from 2099 created a time gateway. It was a one-way trip that dumped him sometime in the 1970s. He then used his advanced knowledge to build Alchemax, years before it was supposed to be established, transforming your world and mine. But I work for Alchemax. You're saying that's somehow wrong? Completely. At this point in time, you earn a living taking news pictures for J. Jonah Jameson. <laughs> The late-night ranting TV news guy? <laughs> forget it. You can't forget it. Where does this so-called death happen? Sloane's building another gateway on the 66th floor, so he can finally travel back and forth. I saw you being killed, right there. By who? I couldn't make it out. It doesn't matter. Get out of the building! So a crazed killer can wander around the building without me to stop him? No way. Besides, if I find this guy somewhere else, then I'm invincible, because I can only die at the gateway, right? It's not an exact science, Parker. Meaning what? You want to spend an hour getting a crash course on temporal physics? No? Then do what I say. <laughs> You've got a lot to learn about priorities, pal. I'm gonna do what I think is right, and that means going after bad guys. You want a Spider-Man who'll do whatever you want? Go play a video game. What's that? Spider sense. Save yourself from me. Eddie Brock? Anti Venom? He's the one gunning for me? But he's reformed. Hostile intruder detected in sector AC 78. I've got the intruder sight. Teleporting guards in? That's spiffy new tech. All employees, we are in a state of heightened security. We apologize for any inconvenience or possible loss of life. Thank you.
What? What did you say? I can't hear you. We need to work out the kinks of this time travel communications thing if it's gonna have any hope of catching on. Parker, focus on what's important. I am, which is why I'm heading up to the 66th floor. If that's where we're supposed to butt heads, maybe I could draw them out en route. I'm gonna go look for an elevator. Do you want to die? Of course not. I want to run away even less. Press elevator going all the way up to the 66th floor. Ah, shot. What happened? The elevator I'm in just changed into a closet. Huh. Rock just tried to kill me with an elevator. Weird coincidence. Maybe not. Wait, 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 wait. Something I did here had an effect on you in 2099? That's impossible. No, theoretically, it's not. The idea is called quantum causality. The two gateways created a link between our times like a wormhole through the fourth dimension. Right. Normally changing the past just creates an alternate timeline. But thanks to the wormhole, what you do there affects my time, and vice versa. So I can change things here, now, that can immediately change things in the future? That's amazing. Spectacular, even. The security system has all the entrances blocked. I gotta come back here after I take out the security mainframe. Parker, my path to the 66th floor is blocked by some kind of force field. Welcome to my world. Come on. 
take out the security mainframe before things get worse. Hi, um, is it okay with you if I destroy that security mainframe behind the glass? Protect security mainframe! Eh, it's worth a shot. Security seals have been implemented on all major access points. All non-intruders remain at their stations so as not to be targeted. Oh, come on, Spidey, take out the security mainframe before things get worse. Shopping Alchemax. Do come again. Spidey, take out the security mainframe before things get worse. I'm about to destroy the security mainframe. How you doing, O'Hara? You still stuck? Yeah. Well, listen and learn, newbie. That's all both of problems, right? My force field just changed into centuries. Robot guards. This whole quantum causality thing is a real wild card. I can't control if it makes things better or worse. Well, at least I can get through the door now. Could it run both ways? Affecting my time as well as yours? Impossible. Because it's happening. All the bad guys just froze. And by that I mean it's possible.
Okay. Now to get back to that sealed door through the elevator shaft. The force field should be down by now. So you keep saying, Eddie, fight whatever is doing this to you.
You realize this time travel story of yours is gonna cost me my job. It's not your job. It's not even your reality. Yeah, that's what you keep saying. But how do you know? Because I do. And deep down, so do you. Now let me concentrate. I have my own problems right now. Yeah, well, I can't help you with that. Maybe you can. Parker, you're making this harder for me, not easier. I told you trying to control this quantum causality thing was a stupid idea. They said penicillin was stupid, too. You're talking about the fabric of reality, not Redmond. Just get ready to help me. Redmond, sheesh. I cannot believe his crust. elevator I need is right at the end of this hallway. Parker, I'm in the jam and you put me there. Hey, I was having a quiet evening until you started talking inside my head. Don't blame me for this. All right, fine. What do you need me to do? O'Hara? Great. He's gone. I can hardly stand. about this whole quantum causality thing. Learn faster! Okay, I'm there. I'll destroy the prototype parts and we'll see what happens. At least one of us will. <laughs> Where's 
the most part. Do they turn into something else? Like, I don't know, kittens? Yeah, small, metal, robotic, killer kittens. Aww. Thanks for getting me out of there. Kind of proves the quantum causality theory. Just tell me who wins the next 10 World Series and we'll call it even. The world what? You're killing me, Mara. I'm not. But you will you go to the 66th floor. 66th floor, I know. And we both know we won't do what I have to. Okay, fine. Plan A, keeping you out of danger isn't working. Then we'll go for plan B. I'll get down to my own 66th floor and see if we can solve this thing. I'll try not to die. Here. Max isn't kidding around. I need a security pass for that door, and I'm hemorrhaging time, especially if Parker arrives before I do. If only he had listened to me. I need your built-in passkey. Hand it over.
slow down. Wait for me to get to my 66 floor. Instead of my slowing, how about you hurry? Ah, figures. Another locked door. Every door in here is sealed. So little trust in the world these days. Parker, a hallway here just changed. It wasn't me. Maybe Brock smashed the wall or something. I'm just trying to stay alive. If you were, you'd clear out. But you have to prove your bravery. Bravery? Dude, there is nothing I would like better than to just hightail it out of here. Then why the shock don't you? Because what I do here matters, okay? Beyond changing hallways into elevators, it matters. And that's just something I have to live with, even if it means I die with it. You get it, O'Hara? Whatever. Find the right sentry robot.
Yeah, kind of. Look, sorry I wigged out earlier. It's not cool. It's okay. At least now I know you understand the stakes. Glad to know you see it my way. <laughs> Just keep telling yourself that. So, where are you? Nearly where you don't want me to be. Slow down, would you? How about you speed up? Yeah, I'll get right on that. Only way to move fast enough is to go free fall in the elevator shaft. Shortest distance between two points is a straight line. On my way, Parker. Parker? That's ominous. Especially since I'm the one who keeps having to bail you out. I'll keep worrying until this is done. How close are you to the 66th floor? Parker? Shh, shut up. I just spotted Brock. I'll be in touch. Parker! Parker, are you... Oh, great. I've got to wrap this thing up before it turns into an even bigger disaster than it already is.
there's an alternate route. It'll slow me, but I can still get to the 66th floor from here. Looks like the only way up to the 66th floor is through the ventilation. This is nuts. Old nuclear plants had less protection than this.
Parker, I made it to the 66th floor. Where are you? Is this anti-venom still hiding? I'm face to face to face with anti-venom. Eddie, you're responsible for the explosions? Try it. Blow you up. If you were really trying, you'd have done it. What's going on? Kill you. Now! What's happening there, Parker? Anti-Venom's fighting himself more than he is me. Some 